Hello, hi, how are you today? In today's video, I wanna pose a few questions to you. Are you feeling restricted? Have some of the things that you've been doing, maybe they're not working that well for you. So I wanna tell you something, no amount of celery juice is gonna help you integrate your light body. That's just a little joke I have uh, because there's people that are going willy-nilly out there trying to figure out what to do. When it comes to ascension, particularly twin flame ascension, where there's two energies involved, there's a lot to know about it, but it can be very concise and precise. So one of the things particularly for women is that you will hit a patch where you feel restricted, stuck, out of ideas, and it is like feeling like a restricted stuck energy. Now, this has to do with your reproductive system, but not a part that you think of. It has uh, connections in the upper body. There's things that need to shift and move so that you can have the breakthroughs that you need. Some of those breakthroughs are going to be your entrepreneurial spirit. Whether or not you actually create a business, you will feel freshly infused with ideas and creative energy. And sometimes for my clients, this has led to promotions. It has led to the complete uh, forming of a new department, which they've been put in the head of. Um, I recently have someone who has worked for a large food company where they are splitting up and yet she needs energy for that brand new thing that she is a part of. Sometimes, you know, people put the cart before the horse. They leap and then they try to fix it and other people will, you know, have more of a gradual buildup. That's most people. They have more of a gradual buildup. Why? Because you need your foundations. It's no different with your brand new twin flame body. The twin flame body is a brand new foundation where you can hold double the love. I'm saying double sort of as like a metaphor. It is like an unlimited amount of love, okay? There's no limits on it. It's not just times two. It is unlimited depending how far you go with it. This is the most brand new thing in the universe. And most people are treating it like it's a crisis or drudgery. Stop treating your ascension like a crisis. Help other people stop treating their ascension like a crisis. There's a thing that's happening. That old foundation, it's crumbling. It is not going to sustain old things, old relationships, old ways of giving birth, old ways of creating, old ways of all the same old people doing the same old things, the same old addictions. Addictions at all, it's not going to hold that. It doesn't want to hold the illness. It wants to hold love. So your twin flame body is designed to hold love and create solutions from that love it's holding while deflecting a lot of the negativity and letting you ascend, letting you continue on your way and gradually improve and gradually up level. So whatever words you like to use, upgrades, up level, ascension. It all amounts to the same thing. It's you going from here up here. And to keep going and getting to those convergence points, getting to those times when you merge and you click in with each other. Because otherwise, without love, why is this all worth it? You know, a lot of people will get to the point where they feel a masculine feminine balance and they start saying, I'm okay, I could do without that twin. Now, sometimes people don't know what to do with the emotions that are in them. Hatred, hatred and love cannot live and coexist in the same place. What that means is this. If you have someone that you've been latched onto that you think in your mind is your twin, and yet you're filled with hatred, it's time to join the class to get rid of the hatred. And you may wind up finding out who that person is to you and what they really did to you. Or you may find out that there's blocks that help you improve and you can get where you're going and into the relationship you really need to be in. So it's hard to reconcile for people when their mind gets involved. This is why I focus on the body. This is why when I focus on the body, the body takes over. And if you're not listening to your body, you need to listen to your body. So this is why some of these things are unmistakable. You feel restricted, you feel stuck. You feel like you're not getting ahead. You're wondering when certain things are gonna end. 
You can feel sluggish. Is it hard to get up in the morning? Do you feel like there's no point in getting up? You're just going through the motions or, oh, it's just another day. Are you finding it hard to take breaks? Are you finding it hard to truly break away so that you can actually feel refreshed? I also teach about that how to do it so that you get those breakaways. There are things that happen naturally, just like the seasons happen naturally, where things can go a little bit asleep and then it pops up again. It starts to come to life again. There is a natural ebb and flow. You don't feel the love the same way at all the time. The love ebb and flows, but it never ever says goodbye to you. You have to expand up into it. That's when you are being proactive and that's the level you want to live in. Do you have brain fog? Do you find yourself feeling a little scattery, foggy? You're not sure. You kind of are lacking enthusiasm. Are you feeling forgetful? Do you just want to sleep a lot and nap? Okay. So there are things that we talk about and do you feel no direction? Are you not sure where things are going? Well, here's the beautiful thing. When you're engaging with your light body, that light body, the brand new twin flame body and the template of 5D relationship is actually has designed to help you, to help open the doors for you, to help make the introductions to the right people and not with the no direction. Now, this, these retrogrades have been bringing out a lot of hidden stuff. And this is some of the hidden stuff, particularly for women. What women have been subjected to, what we've had to bear up under, even after bearing all the children, all the things that we've been holding on our shoulders and enough is enough already. You can't truly be liberated unless you have these breakthroughs. There's no point to going out and marching and saying, hey, women's liberation, unless you can actually create and be at the level where your gender really isn't the issue. Your reproductive system is not an issue whatsoever. Your love energy, your divine feminine energy is the driving force of your life balanced with divine masculine energy. And this is true no matter where you are on, you know, how you identify as your sexuality. If you're a lesbian, if you're a straight woman, if you're ultra femme, and if you're kind of tomboy, it doesn't matter. These parts of you are natural parts designed to help you for your existence. This is your existence. Now, sometimes people say you only get one life. Well, no, you have more than one life. You can come back for another karmic life or you could do this now and start getting it together. <laughs> start and, you know, get some direction because the main direction is forward and up. When you have people that they are feminine, they look feminine on the outside, but they have a balance of masculine and feminine energy. The electric feminine and electric masculine is the forward action. The magnetic masculine and feminine energy is the creative one. It's like the part that gathers in, helps you form and create. You need both. You need to formulate, create, you need to move it forward. Your brand new template of relationship helps you to relate mentally, emotionally, intelligently. It helps ramp up your senses so that you're able to not only rely on your senses, but have the proper sense, sensibility, the common sense for some people, because sometimes this journey can make people almost delusional. You don't know what to think, what to believe. What happens with that? I would say focus on integration of your twin flame body, brand new template of relationship, so I am hosting a brand new class coming up. It is intended as a 14 day transformation starting October 15th, a daily twin flame body breath and juice. I'm going to teach you how to juice. And that's why I joke that no amount of celery juice is going to get you there, but I will teach you what juice helps and why it helps. And we will, we're going to do it. I'm doing it. Okay. Unlike other people who have uh, things that they don't even tell you their real name, I'm here with my real name. I'm just like going through this. And yet I have formulated the plan 
and I have a modality that works. We get results with this modality. So try the 14-day transformation. You'll be glad you did. You feel transformed by the end of it. You have to show up, and I will say this, this is a somewhat mildly active class. If you have some impairments, please inform me. Let me know. We try to do some workarounds for that. I get guidance on the workarounds. I get guidance through the whole thing because this is not coming from directly from my mind. My mind is used to format it for you, to learn how to work Zoom. That's what my mind is for. The rest is the high-level, multidimensional energy and love that we are utilizing that I am a teacher and healer and multidimensional teacher for this and guide. So if you don't think you're a multidimensional person, try going back to living in 3D or 2D where you're just a little caricature of a person. We don't recommend it because that's not who you are. Let's bring out all of your sparkling, multidimensional, multifaceted self. That's what I love doing with people because there is more to you than meets the eye. So check it out. Here's my website, twinflamerayconnection.com or email me at twinflamerayconnection at gmail. Thanks so much. Have a great day. Bye.